all that much. Let me go ahead and uh, disconnect. So let's hop back on into the action with Stoic and make it a bud for our second match of the tournament. All right. So all right. Well, it's like here we go again, match. guys. Yep, should be Let's the exact see. same drafts going into this one. Free bands coming out. We know the Ragdoll, the Barbara, and then we should be seeing the exact same drafts. That first pick coming out of Rosslip, and then so on with X Knight X. I mean, wow, so impressive. These players able to draft without thinking, laying things down so quickly. I mean, they clearly done their homework here. Definitely done their homework here. <laughs> same bands oh, so this as well, of course. So in this draft here, you're gonna see a turn two play coming from X Knight X, and his draft is likely gonna be able to take out a unit of Rossus. I don't think he has enough, Rossus has enough burst here. Nope. Well, we're going into our match right now with X Knight X96 and Rosslip, our last year's European Cup champion. Here we go, guys. Does land that reset on the Savannah with the Okeanos. Gets that strip defense break on top of Fran. Shred is coming out to deal some serious damage to the Fran. And CR is going to be primed and ready with this bomb on top of Fran. Quickly detonating it. We're getting into this thing real fast. Well, I stand corrected here. That does that. Uh, Dark Monkey did so much damage, and that Vigor also did a ton of damage here. So X Knight X actually does use, lose a unit off the bat here. Uh, so X Knight X is actually on the back foot in a pretty rough spot, but that Praha is going to be able to put everything to sleep. That's right, Praha is going to be using that third skill, healing up just a little bit, putting everybody to sleep here. Is he still going to be taking advantage of that defense break on top of Ciara? We're going to find out. Or is he going to focus down the Dark Monkey King? And he is with that additional turn as well. Yeah, definitely does not want to wake up the other units, but kind of in a rough spot here because now he's stunned up and he loses tempo and Savannah doesn't have skills up yet, so he just doesn't have the ability to get speed buff on his team. He's not going to be able to take anything out in trade units. That is correct. And we had that second skill coming out of the Vigor, healing up a little bit, gets the speed buff and that anti-crit up as well. Defense break sitting on top of Masha. Ciara choosing to go after the Savannah and not capitalize off of the, uh, the defense break on Masha, but that is fine. It's building a little bit of attack bar there. Yeah, Ross is in a really good spot here. He has anti-crit up on three units here. Uh, this Okeanos is going to be able to survive pretty much anything. And that Vigor, while it did a lot of damage, likely on CD build, again, just not enough steam in uh, X Knight X's hands left, and he's going to lose this one. Yep, that's right. Bomb does land on top of uh, top of the Praha. We get the additional turn coming out of the Mash. Is it going to be enough damage to finish out the Ciara? Definitely not. Shred's going to be coming out here looking for a defense break. Doesn't matter. Rosslith is taking round one against X Knight X. Yeah, very well drafted by Rossett there. I mean, took out the Fran early, clearly understood the speeds of the match and knew the turn orders coming out. So his win condition was sniping out the Fran, resetting the Savannah. Uh, so in that situation, drafted very well. And of course, uh, banning out the Vanessa so that, you know, once a unit is gone, it's gone forever. Yeah, very quick play coming out of Rosslip. Very certain, very uh, well-controlled, well-thought-out draft coming from Rosslip. And that's ex exactly what we all expect to see coming from a European Cup champion. Yeah, exactly what we need to see. And, and actually for X Knight X, I mean, if he wanted to win, he needed either Oki to resist uh, the re or the Savannah to resist the reset from Oki or the Fran to resist the defense break. Uh, getting hit with the skill two from the Oki is about a 70% chance. And, get, and the Fran getting hit with the defense break, I think it's about, I think it's just a standard 85%. So you're looking at pretty close to a 60-40 split there in terms of who's going to win. 60% uh, being who's going to, if, if Rossip can land everything or not. It really does come down to probabilities um, when you're thinking about taking first turn and popping a unit and how many things are going to land correctly. It comes down to that. Rossip did the math in his head, uh, and that's how he was able to come on top there. Well, here we go, guys. We're getting into round two with Rossip and X Knight X. Pre bans are coming out. We see that Doc Monkey King getting pre banned by X Knight. He doesn't want to see it again. And Ciara getting pre banned by Rossip. Yeah, I mean, Dark Monkey, very, very strong unit here with the high base speed and the ability to strip and add defense break uh and then aoe stun it just does so much as an ld unit uh and then sierra of course a pre ban because it is a very strong unit in this meta uh x knight x responded with a fran first pick which is an interesting first pick kind of puts him locks him in that 270 280 speed range which allows rasa to either go and out speed uh, or actually go completely turn two if he wants and so far he's looking like he wants to go for speed with the vanessa okeanos and Vanessa Okeanos for Ross with an X Knight X looking at a Vigor. We've seen a lot of Vigor coming in at this time of the match. Yeah, so X Knight X 96 dropping that Vigor and likely to also going to add probably some sort of Josephine or Molly. It goes with the Savannah. So interesting take on the Savannah when there's two fire units left on Ross's side. Uh, so, you know, and if Ross immediately drops a Triana and the uh, 
the uh, Ragdoll here. I'm not sure about that Triana drop because Triana tends to be a very stationary unit, but it is quite good into Vigor and Savannah. Ooh, interesting draft coming out of x Knight. We're going to be seeing a Molly, which obviously the combination of Molly and Vigor is very, very powerful. Yeah, and it's not just that, but if you look at Rasta's side, once Vanessa's defense break is gone, he lacks a lot of burst. And this game is all about burst and being able to take a unit down because there's so much heals coming out from X Knight X's side here. So taking the Vigor, he's going with the turn cycling comp. Uh, if you want to note that Vigor and Savannah do have disynergies and that both bring speed buff. So the, the, the two are not great together. I think uh, Ethna is definitely going to be the ban here. X Knight X, when he drafts this way, is planning on surviving that burst and whatever burst Rasset may have. Rosset's win condition is landing a defense break from that uh, Vanessa and then killing with the Ragdoll. But I really like X Knight X's uh, draft here, as long as some sort of glancing can protect that Savannah from going back. Well, let's see if X Knight X can outlast Rothleth going into round two between the both of them. X Knight X needs to win this one if he thinks he's going to be holding on and staying in this competition. Here we go. We have first turn V taking by Rosseth. We've got Okiano step up with a nice uh, strip reset. Let's see if it's going to be landing on top of that Fran potentially. Yeah, I think it should be going on this Fran here uh, because the Triana does move in front of Savannah, means he's going to be able to get immunity up on his team to protect himself from defense breaks. And that's why he's going for the attack bar reduction on that Triana. Uh, but again, there's that rank on the side, which means that everything moves up in the attack bar. Uh, Okeanos moves moves next, moves later on. It's going to do a lot of damage to uh, x You can definitely see all that damage coming up from Vanessa on top of Fran. Getting the defense breaks on all of Rosso's units, almost removing that Triana from the field. <laughs> definitely a, a great stat for x Knight. Huge amount of damage coming out of that Triana. Let's see if Rasa picks up on that and switches targets, and that's exactly what he does here. Recognizes that in order to do that much damage, you must be squishy, and you see that Savannah's already past half HP. Well, X Knight does have the sustain on his team to potentially keep his team alive. Looking for the strip on the immunity on top of the Triana. It does receive it there. Possibly going for an attack break on a Ragdoll. Does receive that attack break as well. Reign of Stones does not stun up everybody on X Knight's team. He still has that Savannah. Savannah was looking to finish off the Triana. Doesn't do it yet and gets it on the second time. He gets revived back with the Vanessa passive. Yeah, and actually, this is quite a tanky Savannah. It's actually not dying right away, but again, has defense break on and might go down here. Ooh, does go down here. Not looking good for X Knight. That's his big source of damage. Ragall attack broken, still dealing plenty of damage there. Okeanos could finish off here with the first skill and does so. Yeah, and X Knight X needs to take out that Triana right now and then survive over time, but decides to go after Vanessa and change targets. Not going for damage on that Triana. I don't know if, th if this is going to work long term. Don't think he has enough damage to take out Rossi's side at this point. I don't think X Knight's going to have the damage here. He has plenty of sustain, but it's just not going to do enough here. Rossif has got way too much gas in the tank with the units that he's got on the field right now. Okeanos possibly looking for a strip reset on top of the Vigor and does not receive it there. Yeah, and X Knight X's window of opportunity is landing a defense break on that Vanessa. He has picked up that Vanessa. He's quite squishy here, but X Knight X needs to get a speed buff online if he wants to start outpacing Rossif and come back. He's not over by any means. He definitely has a chance to come back. And his window of opportunity is using Fran with skill one and then skill three coming out with Vigor to take out that Vanessa Sue Triana pass. Yep, he's trying to get those attack breaks to limit the damage on Roth's side of the field. Does land that attack break onto the uh, Ragdoll. Ragdoll going for more damage on top of Vigor. Yeah, and if you note that uh, Vigor's taking quite a bit of damage, so I wouldn't be surprised if that was on crit damage build. So that does do a lot of damage. But again, at the same time, I mean, X Knight X is kind of on the back foot here. Does need to cycle and proc a lot if he wants to. Yeah, I do believe it is on a crit damage build. You see that he didn't have to use that heal on the Vigor, but chose to do it because he knows, I think we can tell, that is not that tanky of a unit. He's looking to get as much damage that he can on this field using that Vigor. Yeah, both players excellent at counting cooldowns here. That immunity preventing Vigor from landing skill three uh, with that defense break. So that's exactly what X Knight X needed to do and wasn't able to get it. Yep, most definitely. Ragdoll almost finishing off the frame there. Frame with the additional turn, trying to get this uh, Vanessa down as much as possible. Not looking good for X Knight X anymore. Landing that reset on top of the Vigor as well. You can see the damage from the Triana still trying to pummel away at this poor Vigor. Vigor is going to be going down here shortly. Yeah, massive damage coming out on that Triana. That does so much damage. Uh, and again, Rossip looking so strong here. Rossif looking very strong, getting the 2-0 on X, Knight X. Rossif is going to be moving forward in today's tournament.
Yeah, what a game here. And of course, uh, Ross is waving his lucky charm, that violent uh, rune to the uh, camera. I don't know if he needed that any violent procs there. I don't think he got too many in that game either. I just think it came down to that Triana not being taken out, that Savannah.